Hey guys, really quick one for today. If you've not already heard by now, the Mini 2 has a bit of an issue with its intelligent flight batteries. Now don't panic, it's nothing crazy, but it's something you should be aware of and take action, especially if you're not a frequent flyer. Now the good news is that DJI is aware of the issue and is working on a fix, so hopefully this will be remedied very soon. Anyhow, basically what is happening is that the Mini 2's intelligent flight batteries are not automatically discharging when left in the drone or the two-way charging hub. So why is this an issue? Well, unlike the original Mavic Mini, which uses lithium ion batteries, the DJI Mini 2 uses lithium polymer or LiPo batteries. And simply put, lithium polymer batteries do not like being stored for any length of time, fully charged or fully depleted. Doing so may affect the battery health, their longevity, and potentially lead to more serious problems such as battery swelling, which at that point, the battery is done and should be replaced. Now, here's where the intelligent part of these batteries is supposed to come in. According to DJI, a fully charged Mini 2 battery left unused should discharge to 96% after one day, and after five days, that same battery should discharge down to about 72%. The problem is that when the batteries are left in the charging hub or the drone itself, the auto discharge function does not work. So if you charge your Mini 2 batteries up to 100% in the two-way charging hub or the drone and just leave them there, they will not automatically discharge. Leaving them in that fully charged state for too long could affect the longevity of the batteries and ultimately you may have to replace them sooner than expected. Now, I did run some tests with my own Mini 2 batteries and yeah, they don't automatically discharge when left in the hub or the drone. If I left the batteries just sitting around on a shelf or something, the auto discharge function worked as expected. So until DJI fixes the problem, the easiest way to deal with this issue is just don't store your batteries in the hub or the drone. Easy peasy. If you're worried about your batteries because they've been sitting in the charging hub or drone and you haven't used them for a while, no problem. Just pop them out and after a few days, check to see if they're discharging properly. If they're not, you can fire up your Mini 2 and run it for a bit to get those batteries down to about 72% or three lights remaining. Now, one last trick here. If you're like me and you like transporting and storing the batteries in the hub, well, my friend Don Joyce came up with a really simple solution. Just take an elastic band, the wider the better, and wrap it around the charging hub covering the contacts so the batteries cannot make a connection. It's easy to do and it works great. The only snag is that the batteries don't stay in. They fall out really easily. So the easiest way to deal with that is just take another elastic band and wrap it around, making sure to cover the batteries. And there you go, problem solved. Anyhow, that's it for this one, guys. If you haven't been flying your Mini 2 for a while and the batteries are in the drone or the charging hub, as a precaution, go run over to your Mini 2 right now and pop those batteries out so you don't forget. But before you do that, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and yep, you guessed it, I will see you in the next one. Bye.